The governor of Lagos State, Babajide Sawolu, has called on the House of Representatives to allow state governments to have inputs into the 2022 electricity bill. Governor Sawolu stated this during the handover ceremony of the Lagos State Integrated Energy Resource Plan, IPR, by the head of Power Africa, Mark Karato. Plus TV News correspondent, Lavi Koko Oyedokun, tells us more. In this the Lagos State Integrated Resource Initiative is a 20-year partnership. The project is being undertaken by the Lagos State Ministry of Energy and Mineral Resources in collaboration with the United States of America through USAID and Power Africa, Nigeria Power Sector Program. It is believed it would transform power deficiencies in Africa, which will allow states to generate their own electricity and develop at their own pace. It's about the power, the power of partnership. You know that I, I see it um, will, and, and you, you started very, very well. You know, eight years ago, when your former president started this um, Power Africa initiative, which you know um, you were part of, you know, um, um, way back then. Um, it's something that we believe, um, and if we all, all run it well, will certainly transform, you know, the power um, deficiency in Africa. And the most critical thing is these are going to be implemented by Africans with some sort of like an African solution in different jurisdictions. The Lagos State Chief Executive, however, calls on the Speaker of the House of Representatives to ensure that all issues on the electricity bill are resolved. Want in that bill for the honorable members of the House of Rep to call the governors or to call the subnational, the state, so that we have proper input into this bill, so that we can, you know, finally, finally, you know, unbundle all of the bottlenecks in the private, in the power sector, so that we and they can see what our challenges are, and we can sit down together and they can bring about, you know. A, a bill that is bankable, a bill that will help, you know, um, uh, private sector funding and financing into this sector, and a bill in which everybody can move at their pace. Olalere Odushote is the State Commissioner for Energy and Mineral Resources. He says the initiative involving the two electricity distribution companies in Lagos, Ikeja and Ecodiscos, will boost power supply. From the advent of this administration, he has made it clear that electricity is a focus of his. And one of the ways we've identified towards achieving the electricity transformation of Lagos is to take Lagos State distribution away from the national grid. This IRP helps us document the infrastructure requirements and the gaps that exist. And it gives us, it gives Lagos State a medium term, a short term, and a long term strategy to achieving the power sector stability that we want. The benefit of uninterrupted electricity to economic growth, trade and investments cannot be overemphasized, but Nigeria is not there yet. The electricity program is said to be a 20-year plan. Love Ikuku Oyedoku, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.